Hi, this is Vicky with Condi Systems, and I'm going to show you how to use uh, the power driver choosing substrates for particular images. Um, say, for instance, I was going to take this image and put it on a tile. I need to know what the tile is made of, and that would be ceramic. If it were a mouse pad, um, or if it were cloth, I would need to know something about the materials so that I can properly choose a substrate. I get questions about um, choosing substrates using the power driver and I just want to make a really short brief, uh, video that will um, clarify how to choose substrates in the power driver if you are printing to the power driver. We at Condi choose the ICC profile but the power driver is available for those who want it and those who have questions about how to choose substrates this, is, this video will help. So uh, to choose a substrate, first off, when you go to print from Corel Draw or any other applications choosing the power driver, you're going to, uh, first off, you need to make sure that your color management is turned off. Um, so the power driver chooses color, and therefore anything in the application, uh, color management should be turned off. And how you do that is you go to the tools, and then color management, and drop down and you should have a setting in here that says color management off. Okay, once you've done that, uh, you just click OK. And with the power driver, you'll go to File. You'll left click on Print. Um, you'll find your power driver from your drop down. So you're not going to print to the actual original driver. Um, when you're using the power driver, you're going to choose the power driver itself. So you're going to scroll down and find the power driver for, the, in this case, the GX7000. I'm going to left click on that. Now that I've chose that, I need to go to Properties. And Properties, I need to choose a paper size. So um, this is going to be Landscape. And uh, I'm going to use my bypass tray because I have a pretty big uh, printout here. Go to layout, uh, virtual printer, and uh, I need to uh, choose 13 by 19, which I did. Media Street, uh, 31 pound is what I want to choose here. And as far as my substrate, this is what's important. This is the question I get. Choosing your substrate, if I'm going to use a tile, I'm going to I'm going to go in here and select ceramic and that's going to let the power driver know how much saturation is going to help control the color and the saturation on the product that I'm using and for tile that's going to be ceramic so I'm going to choose the ceramic paper type is media street 31 pound uh, I'm not going to change this right here I'm going to leave it on realistic um, I've got my paper type chose and my copies is one and uh, just for um, sake of um, mirror is always selected by default in the power driver so should that not be selected with ceramic tile you certainly want to select that. I'm going to click OK and now I have an image ready to print um, so again um, I've chosen the power driver and I went to properties chose my settings and chose my paper size my substrate my media type all this is correct mirrored the image um, and then I clicked OK. I have a landscape selected here under the layout and uh, miscellaneous nothing to do here nothing to do here and now I'm just ready to print so I would say apply and print and uh, that's how you choose the power driver substrate and choose your paper type and paper size when uh, for you folks who choose to use the power driver. Again, my name is Vicki. I'm with Condi Systems. I hope this video has helped. If you have any questions or concerns, you can contact us here at Condi Systems. Thank you for your time.